Well, one of the examples of a short-sighted decision um, was um, the World Health Organization and an expert uh, group there some time ago, ago said, what we need to do is find women who are at high-risk pregnancies, basically women who are, are going to have very big risk of, um, of having a bad birth outcome because they're at high risk. And this got quickly accepted by many people, thinking, oh yes, this is the way to go. And it took 20 years of work to show that actually didn't work, that even a woman who was actually quite healthy during pregnancy might have an unexpected catastrophic event. The famous supermodel Christy Turlington um, had uh, had nearly bled to death during her uh, second pregnancy uh, in a New York hospital. And in response, Christy has set up um, uh, All Mothers Count, an NGO, to work on maternal, uh, maternal death. And this realization that you can't pick out the high-risk women started quickly and it took years to dispel and to the credit of the Indian government and then the officials at that time, they realized that what they needed to do was to get all women to try to deliver in facilities. So the JSY scheme that pays women 2,000 rupees to deliver in facilities has been, in my view, a spectacular success because it didn't say high risk or low risk. It said, let's get all women because you don't know what would happen in that really difficult time, the emergency uh, delivery time. So I think there are examples of those uh, that, uh, that we have learned in public health. And it's absolutely true. Sometimes a bad idea will take hold and it takes real patience and effort with good ideas to undo the bad idea. And that takes much longer. Mm -hmm.